uh, happy that you can be a part of this. We want to go now to Las Vegas, Nevada, and go to Ryan Lewis, who is the CEO of Global Cannabinoids and, uh, you know, hand sanitizer. That's where you are these days? Yeah, it's actually, it's, it's pretty uh, unbelievable that now we're manufacturing hand sanitizers, but, um, you know, our company, Global Cannabinoids, we're one of the largest producer distributors of hemp-derived cannabinoids, CBD oil, and we're always analyzing trends in the industry, looking for, you know, interesting products that we can combine our cannabinoid ingredients with. And a lot of people don't know that cannabinoids actually have antibacterial and antimicrobial properties. So it, it, it makes for a logical addition into any product formulation that would be antibacterial. Um, last year, we launched a CBD infused soap and that did extremely well. So we had our eye on sanitizer and we were analyzing Google search results for consumers and noticed a spike in sanitizer. So we decided to launch a cannabinoid infused hand sanitizer. And so we added uh, cannabinoids into a base formula that's manufactured at one of our partners facilities. You know, it's uh, according to FDA regulations, it's 70% ethanol alcohol with vitamin E and moisturizers. Um, but the demand we've been getting for sanitizer since then is unbelievable. You know, we've also donate a portion of all, all the sanitizers that we're manufacturing to first responders, medical professionals in need here in Las Vegas. Um, but yeah, I mean, you know, in situations like this, you know, it's, it's imperative that you adapt as a business. And, um, you know, the demand right now is for sanitizer, yeah. and we're in a great position Ryan, to provide that. I, I, from what I hear, the demand for CBD in general and, and deliveries is up across your industry. Uh, I'm wondering in capacity and the ability, I mean, it's hard to find hand sanitizer anywhere. You know, how much are you making? Are you seeing that demand, the supply meet the demand? And is there an, you know, an up cost for buying hand sanitizer with the CBD in it? So ironically, the, the reality is, is that we're actually making more sanitizers without any CBD. Um, you know, being from the cannabis industry, we use ethanol on a regular basis in the extraction process. So we have huge supplies of ethanol. We control supply chains of it. And so we're actually, uh, we've secured contracts for hundreds of thousands of gallons of ethanol per week. We have a facility that then converts it into a sanitizer but you know we're not in the business of price gouging of course when you add cannabinoids to the product formulation the reality is is it's now a premium product cannabinoids are not necessarily cheap however the bulk of our orders right now are for big box retail you know hospital chains and they um, are preferring you know just to get hand sanitizer the, good old the hand sanitizer stuff. Yeah, the basic stuff so are you doing direct to consumers so you have the big orders of the people who are just trying to get enough so they can make sure that everyone is safe and they're and they're making sure the protocols for if you talk about big hospitals or different things like that uh, are you getting direct to consumer people who uh like cbd and and, and like that and ha have had that work for them saying maybe this is an added bonus that i can add to to whatever i was using yeah absolutely we have a brand that we've uh developed called Medically Minded. So we have a hand sanitizer that's launching on uh, medicallymindedcbd.com. And we're actually pricing our cannabinoid infused hand sanitizer. It's cheaper than what you can find online for just regular sanitizers right now. And that's really to meet that consumer demand because we are a bulk and wholesale B2B supplier. So the reality is we're trying to, you know, uh, address all, um, you know, demand in the marketplace and, and get people the products that they need um, in this, you know, in this situation, because, um, you know, this, this, this coronavirus isn't going away for a long time and hand sanitizers, face masks, that's the new norm. Mm -hmm. You know, that's what, that's what our, it's going to be part of our lifestyle going forward. Yep. Absolutely. All right. Ryan Lewis, thanks so much for that. Uh, interesting to hear the innovation and, and how it can impact and really help, you know, whether, whether or not you're using the cannabinoids or you're making the regular sanitizer, uh, I appreciate adding anything to our supply chain right now. Thank you. All right. And if you're just